Welcome back to World Box. But this isn't just World Box. This is the apocalyptic one. A lot of stuff happened over over 200 years. A lot of stuff happened. You can already see a lot of the damage. Hum I just brought humans back to life. Uh, they were they were alive like 100 years ago uh, over here. They, but they all died because they starved to death. But but we have a new problem. We have a new problem. Zombies in the plague. You can see the plague. The purple, the purple effects is the plague. The green effects is the affection that the zombies cause. And the blue effects are regeneration. That's what those are. But mostly the elves got hit hard by the by the plague. There was two hundred people here in the in the prove it to you. That fits two hundred people and there's three two hundred deaths. And now there's only 13 people left. The plague hit, hit these villages hard. The, these guys... I'm pretty sure these guys killed the dwarves. The elves killed the dwarves. The humans starved to death. And the orcs just sat there and did absolutely nothing except for expand. So... Yeah, yeah. There were cold ones here, but they died because I'm gonna show you. I use these. There was a lot of ice towers and flame towers. And when I say there was a lot, I'm not joking. Give me a second. Welcome back. I just had to spawn some more zombies, but I'm gonna show you how many people died from the plague. Deaths by plague. 587 people died by the plague. And like I said, I started the plague in in the elf nation. In the elves. The land of the elves. That's where the, the, the plague started. Oh. Are these people surviving the plague? <laughs> that's a that's a child with the plague. That child's okay. This one's okay. That one's infected. I'm surprised that... Oh, God. So there's basically only children in this village. There's nobody... There's nobody farming or anything. There's only children left in the village. How much food does the village have? How much food does the village have? It's enough for the children to survive. That's that's good. That's great. Oh, there's one. There's one man in the village. One one man. Two? Is that is that a chicken? Is that a chicken? No. That's that's a woman. That's a woman. Okay. It's hard to tell the king's gender because of the crown. But I have to believe that's a woman though, mostly because eleven children. The king, kings that are male usually just sit around and do nothing. Except for going to random fights and die. So, I have to believe that that king's a woman. Because, oh my god! I didn't think elves had longer lifespans than humans. I, I knew they had longer lifespans, but I didn't think they had this long of a lifespan. This king just chillin'. Just chillin'. Zero kills. 
Level three. Okay. 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 But the king's chilling. He's chilling. Doing nothing. While a bunch of children with the plague are running around. You can murder them. Execute Order 66. But with children. Uh, is there anything surprising happening in the orc area? The game is bugging out. But the orcs are... Oh, the king got involved in the fight. He's dead. It seems like the plague spread through the orc villages with the zombie apocalypse. Yeah. Yeah. This is a whole group of infected people, bro. Come on, chief. You should have stayed home. You should have stayed home. Just like the thing said, should have stayed home. But who spread the plague out here? Because I put the plague where the zombies were. That means someone from a different village came here, killed a bunch of zombies, ran away, and then spread the plague throughout the whole village. Who was it? Also, the zombies are slowly dying out right here, but there's a bunch of them over here. That's surprising. A little surprising. Are there any... Ignore that, that was a pixie dying. Uh, just ignore it. There's barely any pixies left. They died with the... They died during the war with the cold ones and the demons. There was like... There was like almost a hundred of them, but then... The demons in the cold ones just cold ones just started murdering them, and and they and once they die they explode basically. So, don't worry about that loud boom sound. That was, excuse me, a rebellion, bruh. How are you gonna rebel when you have the plague in your hands, bro? Your rebellion's gonna be so short. Not because you lost the war, but because your people is just coughing on each other, bro. Stupid. And you dealing with a zombie apocalypse that seems to not be working. Give me a second. Give me. Auto clicker works. <laughs> I spawned a lot of new zombies. The rebellion seems to be doing great, but like I told you, the capital is literally the town where everybody's infected with the plague. And we know what happened to the elves. So, that's something else. Let's see how the humans are doing when they when they came back to to the real world. Surprisingly fine. Surprisingly fine. There's, there's nothing? You want to show me? Nothing? This child's lucky. <laughs> Let's see how long that luck lasts. Let's see how long that luck lasts, bruh. But you, uh, mo most... Oh, I figured out something. The women have ponytails. No man has a ponytail. And if you see a man with a ponytail, most likely they're wearing helmets. Yes. That's what the blue thing on their heads are. If if a soldier gets a helmet, it'll be barely noticeable, but you'll see a little blue thing on the tip of their heads. And that's how you indicate they're wearing a helmet. Really hard to tell. But once you do notice it, it's very noticeable. And this woman is attractive. And she, and, and she has zero kills. 
Let's check this baby. Look. <laughs> this baby's stupid. It has zero kills. Come on, get their child. Come on, someone get their child, right? Bruh, what are you doing, dog? Oh. This is what I told you about. Look, a little little pixie. A little pixie. Little, 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 little. Oh, it's a fairy. Shush, sh shush. Sh it's a fairy, please. Another fairy just died. Go heal these people of their problems. Look. See? Something was attacking this. She's 200 years old. Anyway, someone was attacking this pixie fairy. This fairy. But look. There. I gave you time to read all of that. <laughs> So, yeah, yeah. It seems like that human village is doing fine. The rebellion is getting crushed somehow. I can't see how. Both, both, both countries are dealing with their own problems. The rebellion, the people died because of the plague. And the, now they're slowly being being defeated because of a plague. And the, the original nation is dying because of a zombie apocalypse. A thing that they could easily defeat. Which they have multiple times, but I respawned the zombies. Hello, guy. Infected with the plague. Infected with the plague. Effective with the plague. Wherever you go and right now, orcs and elves are infected with the plague. Humans may not be. The only time that they could be affected with the plague is if the orcs go to war with the humans and the humans win. Because the, the humans won't die out. But the orcs would have carried the plague towards the humans, continuing the lifelong death sequence. <laughs> generations upon generations will fall because of a simple little mistake on on a king's part. Let's go check out the elves. More children, barely any adults. You see, uh, and most of the children are infected with the plague. Great. That's exactly what we need. Little monsters that have, that have a disease that has a 98%, no, a 100% death chance. Everybody that had the plague is dead. I hope you know that. You cannot recover from this plague unless a fairy comes to you and heals you. That's the only time you can recover from the plague. And a lot of fairies are dead. Look, there's one in the forest. That's not, that's, that's a, that's a grasshopper. There's one, that's a fly. A lot of the fairies are dead, apparently. I, we, I guess there's only one left. And she's gonna die from a different reason. A very green we reason. I was gonna say weezen. I guess a lot of the fairies also died from the fires. But I don't think fairies touch the ground. Because if they do, then they'll get affected by the fires. Because flies don't get affected by the flyer, the fires, because they're in the air. But I'm not, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure about fairies. I don't know how they, how they, how their hitboxes act. But yeah, lots of zombies. Lots of zombies. 
Is there a village where people don't have the virus? This woman has the virus. Has the virus. I'm just gonna call it the virus now. Is there one of their beds? No. Oh, the other guy died. But, yep, just make your food when you have the chance. Cause... Oh, she keeled over. <laughs> I think that food's tainted, Chief. You sure you wanna eat that tainted food? A lady just died on it. Are you sure you wanna you sure you wanna put your lips on the food, bro? You sure you can do this? Are you going to survive to see your to see any children spot in your village? Or are you gonna die and let your village fall apart? What are you going to do? Oh, she's he's he's going to die. I can tell it's a he because it's close. Oh, he killed over. Abandoned village. Yeah. Are you guys affected with the virus too? Okay, she's clean. He's clean. Wait, she's clean. He. She's clean? That's a he. Okay. That's a he. Is there anyone else? The child's clean, obviously. I don't know why a child wouldn't be clean. The only children that were affected with the virus is dead. Or they're elves. <laughs> so. Wow. Uh, there's a lot of people... So I guess this is the only clean village in this whole rebellion. That's the only clean village. Let's go over here and prove, prove that. Okay, he's clean. She's clean. Child's clean. The warrior's clean. Wow, wait. This village might be clean, too. Hold on. Let's go to the capital, which only has two people in it. I wonder why. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to find those two people. Oh, no, she's clean. Ooh, we just stubbed my toe. Ouch. Hold on, what's happening here? Oh, they're fighting a zombie. Which means they're affected with... They're infected. They're not affected with the virus. They're literally... Just infected. You don't want to go back into town or you're going to danger everybody in it. Are they both infected? Infected? One-eyed. So, the warrior's fine. She's not. Go, go, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> she didn't even make it to her house in time. <gasps> she kept all her stats. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Never mind, I was looking at the wrong person. Beat, beat, beat that zombie. Okay, so our, the zombie's health is at 50. Let's test how much damage he does with only his fist. That's a lot of damage for a person that's fighting a zombie with their bare hands. Are you affected? He's not. He's immune. He's immune. <laughs> he can save his whole village, bro. He's immune. He can't be affected by the plague, and I don't think he can be affected by the zombie. The zombies. Yeah, yeah, man. But there's still an abandoned village that has a lot of zombies in it. Come back to my next video where the people have to have to liberate villages just to just to get their clean water back. <laughs> See you guys later.
बाय